Okay, this is going to be a video on how to convert your uh, Generation 3 Universal M1 carbine from semi-automatic to a uh, single shot bolt action. It's all right here in your gas tube. What you can do is drive this pin out and it's it's very, I've already got it. I've been banging on for about 10 minutes getting it out. So I thought I'd start the video at this point. You want to see me banging for 10 minutes on this thing. But if you've taken off an A1 or A2 front sight from an AR-15, this is worse. I mean, you really got to bang it. So you're going to go ahead and just take, take that out. We'll go ahead and finish that up now. What am I doing my hammer? And there it came out. And if you lose this pin, um, this is a special hardened pin. Don't just replace it with any with any pin that size. Uh, make sure you go to like uh, gunpartscore.com or something and get you a, an original one because these are specially heat treated. All right, next we're gonna do gotta be a bigger punch right here. Is your gas block, and this is your gas plug up here. This is what we're gonna switch, but you need to knock, grab you a large punch, and you're gonna you're gonna punch your gas your gas block to get your gas plug out on this other side right here. Put this up here. This carpet. Okay, just tap up on your gas block. A large punch. Just see your gas plug start coming out underneath. Like I said, it comes out pretty easy. There they went. You, there's no need in cleaning any of this. Okay, this is your gas plug right here. If you'll notice this notch right here, this gas notch. This was facing towards the barrel. You can't see it in there where your gas comes through. So it went in there like this. The notch was up towards the barrel. All you have to do is rotate this 180 degrees. Go ahead and put your gas block back in there. You're gonna rotate this 180 degrees to where this notch is facing down. You're just going to push that back in there. Until it lines up. Put your push pin hole. And then redrive your pin in. Once you get that in there, then you'll be uh, single shot bolt action. And that's it for how to convert it from a semi-automatic to a single shot bolt action. And if you want to convert it back, just reverse the process. Flip your plug 180 degrees where that notch is facing up towards the barrel. That's it. Thanks for watching.